the idea of saying, wait a minute, let's make a future, let's make this pretty, make it good, make it sweet, make it juicy, make it real, make it, you know, something other than pre-packaged bullshit, I want a future that, you know, is a people's future, out there for everybody, where, you know, you can have a bowl on the table, and say, sit down and have some, not that you have to hoard it, or you have to watch your back to see who's going to take it away from you, but an open, free up future. And I feel that part of my of loving myself, part of being myself is feeling that I'm woman enough, human being enough to, 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 to make that. You know, whether it's cooking it in my kitchen, cooking up in my own, whether it's cooking up on the way, the way I, I see things and the way I do things, I believe in loving the future, loving it enough to make it, and, uh, and make it real, I believe in that, yeah, okay, you know, it's like, I know I love John Coltrane, I know I love, you know, black beans and rice, I know I love my baby. I know I love my mama. Those are concrete loves that I can expand and say I love, you know, people from all places all in the planet. And that's an abstract love, but it's a real love. It's universal. It's, you know, it's something that I'm working on trying to make stronger, trying to make bigger, trying to make heavier, you know. Um, but I think that one of the loves that, that's hardest, I love the future, you know. I want to understand the past, and I work on it constantly, trying to understand. And I work on trying to understand the future, but I don't want to be here, you know. <laughs> I want to go on. I want to open up. I want to free up. I want to, you know, let go. I want to stay with me. I want another kind of world here. I want to be free to love. I don't want nobody. Walk down the street and, and, and look at somebody 